What's up guys? So I'm uh, sitting here at work, a little stressed out, a little wigged out, taking a little break. Just got done um, eating Subway. My wife went and got Subway to sort of chill me out a little bit. So I sat here at my desk, did a little work, ate a little Subway. As you can see, I've got uh, plenty of work to do. <clears throat> Doing about 15 things at once, you know, a little, little, just a little bit stressed out, a little more than I can actually do, to be honest. So anyhow, um, anyhow, sitting here working. Um, gonna start a uh, daily vlog. Um, you know, there'll be some other things included in this, and uh, maybe even talk a little bit about the some of the current events in the world. You know, there's a lot going on in uh, Ukraine, and they just had their presidential elections, and. It looks like things are maybe um, <clears throat> slowly toning down in Ukraine, but there's a lot of other stuff in the world that uh, we need to probably all uh, pay attention to and talk about. Um, there's a lot of movements right now in a lot of countries. Of, um, To be quite honest, there's a lot of nationalist movements in a, in a lot of countries. Um, maybe some of you have heard about the movements in uh, Greece with Golden Dawn. You know, um, I just see a lot of that in the in the news today. <clears throat> a lot of stories about things like that. So there's a lot of that going on. A lot of crazy weather stuff. Um, a lot going on here in the states with uh, with the death penalty and and you know um, Tennessee just last week brought back the electric chair, um, which I'm sure there'll be some court battles about that. So just a, uh, a lot of things going on, and uh, we'll hit through them here in just a little bit. Read through a couple of these uh, news stories. Um, Karzai cheers U.S. withdrawal plan. Of course he does. What a freaking pud knocker this guy has turned into. Not that the uh, Obama administration's had a good plan ever, but uh, <clears throat> are you kidding me? What a joke this freaking guy has become over the years. Um, poet and author uh, Maya Angelou dies at age 86. That's uh, obviously sad and tragic. Um, let's see here. What else we got? No driver, no problem. How Google self-driving car transforms travel. That'll be cool. The Google car. Of course, most of us won't be able to have, afford it for at least 100 years, but Still be cool, I guess, to have a car pass you with no the driver in the back seat. You know, uh, some articles in here about Syria, which is a mess. And I'm sort of glad, I'm actually really glad that we stayed out of that, because I'm not even sure who the bad guy is there anymore. Um, you know, obviously we know what the leader of that country had done in the past. <clears throat> I'm not too sure that the uh, the other groups aren't just as bad. So I think it's maybe a good one to stand on the sidelines and uh, see what happens. Um, little article on Thailand: soldiers attack. Soldiers are attacked with bins and bottles by demonstrators. I think the people are a little tired of all the uh, all the uh, overthrows in uh, in that country. I mean, I. I I watched a news uh, article or read a news article. I can't remember how many um, coups they've had in Thailand in the last hundred years, but it's a lot. It's a lot more than I think anywhere else. So I think maybe the people are a little unhappy with the program there. You know, um, the red shirts and yellow shirts. Let's see, what else we got? Oh, here's a... <laughs> Here's a great one that just makes you go, are you kidding me? Chicago mayor pushes plan requiring all gun cells to be videotaped. Now here's a shocker. Guess who the mayor is? Ron Emanuel. Former White House chief of staff. And best buds with President Obama. So, you know... There's an absolute shocker that uh, they want to videotape us all when we go buy our guns. Why? 
what purpose does that serve? Zero. None. Just another way of tracking us, folks. Wake up, America. Wake up. I love this country. My, you know, I believe in this country. I believe in our military. I believe most Americans are good. But man, pay attention to these politicians because we are definitely headed down the wrong road. Big time. Let's see. Um, Florida court overturns murder conviction of former FBI agent. How bad are the courts? I mean, this is just a little fun thing we'll do maybe once a day. Just read through the news. How bad are, are some of the decisions coming out of the courts? You know, what's really sad is the courts are supposed to be a neutral um, neutral and everything. And, and it sure is funny how they pick sides and how the courts and the judges have become so political. They're nothing but politicians now themselves. They're not fair and impartial. They're politicians. You know, they're supposed to interpret the law and the Constitution. Are you kidding me? They interpret it by what their affiliation is. Not what, not what it says and what's in their heart. So let's see what else we got. Sorry, my arm gets tired. I got to change arms, folks. Huh. Baby killer gets life in prison without parole. I guess at least he gets life in prison. Maybe, um... <laughs> maybe he ought to be serving the time that the baby's getting to serve. You know, instead of living off tax dollars for the next 50 years. You know, the poor baby, the, you know, the, the baby didn't get much of a chance. He didn't give him much of a chance. Anyhow, that's a whole different issue, to be quite honest. Let's see what else we got. Uh, business, boring, boring, boring. Um, nothing big there. These are just the headlines. I'm not drilling down. Not At least not yet. Oh, did you guys hear about this? Cyber attacks that locked up the Apple devices in Australia. And I guess it's reaching here now, so I ain't going to be real happy if my Apple devices get locked up. Um, that's a crazy story. Your phone goes off, and and it says your phone is locked, and you you know email this guy and pay him 100 bucks to unlock it. That's just nuts. One Direction. Members caught smoking pot on video. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. Oops. Pardon my French. Are you kidding me? Honestly. Who cares? Anyhow. But hey, it made headlines. Um, I'm skipping through some of these. Oh my god. If I see one more article about Kim Kardashian and... Kanye West. I'm going to just like freaking vomit. Let's see here. I think I need to go to the gym. My arm's getting tired too quick. Sports. Donald Sterling about selling the team. Okay. That's about it, folks. Oh, wait a minute. I seen something about Seattle's. Ooh. Ooh, a non prescription Cialis is on its way. Whoop, whoop, whoop. So, for us older dudes, <laughs> no prescription, be able to go buy it at uh, Walmart. Speaking of buying, this is, this is for more of the adults here, but speaking of buying Cialis at Walmart, I am shocked at the stuff they have there, like the lubes and, I mean, I know the condoms, but, you know, it's a, it's, it's a little bit funny. You know, I like to go that aisle and embarrass my wife, like, hey, honey, <laughs> do we need some of this? 
So anyhow, so hey, look, they're going to bring Cialis to us without a prescription. Wives and girlfriends, hold on. It's going to get wild. So anyhow, that's it for the um, news. Nothing uh, too crazy. Don't see, uh, I even clicked down. Yep. Yep, don't see anything. Let's let's do the US. Let's see what other stupid things. Oh, Joe Biden's telling the military uh that we need new officer skills. I actually think we need some older officer skills. You know, we need to bring back some of the great military leaders of the past, like George Patton. You know, wars would be a little different, and the way this country's thought of would be a little bit different if we had guys like George Patton and, and um, Chesty Puller. <laughs> Can't get a better one than that, Dan Daly. So, uh, you know, that's about it. So anyhow, this is my vlog for today. A little silly, just getting started. May add a little bit onto it uh, later on the day, um, you know, in this evening. So uh, we'll catch you then.